seen lots of videos out there on mapping, but I haven't seen anything on mapping with the Anafi yet. I figure if Pix4D took the time to write an app for it and Parrot advertises as such, then there's probably a place in the market for it. So I thought I'd try it and put up an example of it. First of all, go to the App Store and download Pix4D. Open up the Settings tab, then click on Drone. You'll see a list of drones show up and pick the Parrot and Avi. The program will ask you if you'd like to download the Pix4D extension, so go ahead and do that, and then open back up your, your um, tablet screen and you'll see it. Now go ahead and open up that extension and um, you'll see the attached screen. The open Pix4D capture option will send you back to the Pix4D main menu, only this time you won't get the free flight mission option. Now I'm not going to cover how to create a mission, but um, after you create one using the advice you get from everybody else on the internet that tells you how to do this, go ahead and um, put it on your project list and open it up. Go ahead and pick your mission and you'll be sent over to another screen where you can start it. When you finish, you'll be sent to another screen designed to, to get you to upload it to Pix4D. So you can either upload it to Pix4D, and if you've got a, um, if you've got, if you haven't used your account already, I would go ahead and use the free account. But if you haven't, you can also load it to any of the mapping software companies. Now I use Maps Made Easy to come up with this image, but if you're wondering why, it's because they don't have a monthly fee or anything. You just pay as you go. So you can buy points from them and, and then do this. This happened to be only 39 images, so um, it turned out to be free. This is the elevation picture that they drew from it. It's actually pretty accurate because over here in this yellowish area, it's, uh, it actually floods when it rains. Now I ran a similar mission the next day with my Phantom 4 Pro and the biggest difference was the cameras. I got a um, 0.38 inches per pixel from the Phantom and the previous day I had gotten 0.52 inches per pixel from the Anafi. So what am I actually trying to say here? I'm no mapping expert, I'm definitely not suggesting you get rid of your Phantom. It'll do the job faster and at the same height more accurately. I am saying that it may be an option though, say if you don't want to make a lot of noise, or you can fly lower to the ground, or say you show up and you've forgotten to ask permission from a foreign country to fly a particular spot, even though the FAA says you can, of course. Still can't get over that. Anyway, hope this helps. Those who own the little guy should try the app for data collection. So, uh, thank you for listening.